you people I'm back with another video and today I have another Amazon nail supply haul for you all um, I'm excited about this video because I finally got some items that I've been eyeing for a while and wanted to try out and a few that were recommendations from other youtubers so before I hop into that I want to first show you all some items that I picked up from my local Dollar Tree I want to start including which you all have already saw me doing including um, nail art supplies I get from other stores locations um, etc within my Amazon nail supply hauls or my Shein nail supply hauls just because I typically don't pick up too many items from those places so first from my local Dollar Tree let me show you all what I found okay we're gonna hit the ground running with this one so I found a ton of these parts so these are just like nail stickers but I thought these were so cute I found them in a lot of different colors so I found them in this kind of yellow goldish looking color okay they also had it in this beautiful pink light pink color mm -hmm. they also had these hearts in red so these hearts are perfect for like Valentine's Day or just whenever you feel like adding different hearts to the nails. They had it in this royal blue. This beautiful green color, the like emerald green almost. And then also just clear. So I picked up, how many? Uh, so I picked up five, no six of these. So I picked up pretty much everything they had. So I really like these. I actually have used these before, these gem stickers before from Dollar Tree and they work really well. You can go over to my Instagram and see how I've applied these gem stickers from Dollar Tree in the past, but these things work really well. And for a buck 25, you can't beat it. Also from Dollar Tree, um, y'all know I have my press on nail series going on right now. So I did pick up some more press on nails. So I got these short stiletto nails that were had these beautiful colorful designs to it. I also picked up these here, which have like the little, I guess it's called drips to it. Um, I found some oval shape, some medium oval shape nails. So I thought these were cute. They kind of have that kind of opal or royal, aurora effect to them. And then they also have that in the purple style. I thought that was a cute shift to it. And then I thought these were just really adorable. So this says love over here with like the arrow. You know, so yeah, I just thought that was really cute. So I picked up some more press-on nails. So yeah, definitely stay tuned to my channel. I On my channel, I've been applying press-ons using different mediums um, and still trying to get them to last like two weeks and look like salon quality nails. So yeah, definitely um, check the description box for some press-on nail tutorials that I've done in the past. I've done it using um, Builder Gel. I've done it using um, acrylic and then I've also done it using adhesive tabs and all methods work really well. The last two items I picked up, so this here I picked up, it's just a makeup brush, but I got it actually to be a dust brush for when I'm doing like my dip powder nails and such. So yeah, that's what this looks like. I thought it was just really cute and I love the handle here. I just thought it was stunning. So yeah, I really just got that for my dip powder nails just to be able to dust off as I'm working. So I picked that up. And then I also just picked up more of one more of these nail art liner brushes from Dollar Tree. So that's everything I got from Dollar Tree. So now on to what I got from Amazon. Y'all, these are some goodies from Amazon. So the first thing I did get is a my first silicone hand. So I have a full unboxing of this item um, already up on my channel. So I'm gonna leave that link in the description too. But I gave this uh, silicone hand its own separate video. But I did want to just kind of show it really quick to you all here. I went ahead and applied some natural tips to it. I haven't had a chance to practice around with it yet, but I just thought it was really cute, nice, and realistic. Um, I paid $42 or $45 for it, and it did come with actual tips, buffer, file, nail clipper, etc. So it came with a lot of extra accessories, which was part of the reason why I got it. But this one looks nice, natural, realistic. I'm still needing to name her, so you all let me know if you have all have suggestions on what I should name my practice hand but she's gonna be cute to be in like videos I'm gonna have her sitting right here and we're gonna be doing her nails okay y'all so get ready for some sets darling it's gonna be great so that's my little practice hand here so this I saw another youtuber haul and honestly as soon as I saw it I had to have it so these are some foils and this comes with a variety of different foils like I'm impressed at how many different colors this comes with but it comes with a red, a yellow, a black, 
a green, a blue, a pink, two different purples, okay, another blue, and then it comes with the standard silver, gold, and kind of like a bronzy color here. So I absolutely love how these foils look. I'm just gonna take out a few of them so you all can kind of see how nice and flaky they are. But I have actually already tested these foils. That's actually what I used on this hand to get this look. I just applied the foils right around where the um, sideways French met and didn't they turn out beautiful? And they were really, really easy to work with. But let me open this up just so you all can see how they look. But isn't this stunning? Oh my goodness. Yeah, that's absolutely beautiful. So that's how the red looks. Let me see, I'll do the black for you all. Oh, the black is messy. I will do the yellow for you all as well. And you all can see these things come full to the top and they are absolutely stunning. Yeah, I had such an easy time working with these. Like they're really easy to pull apart, like no issues at all. And then let me also show you the pink one here, just so you have an idea. But you see how it's full to the top? Like this lid is just like pressed up here. Let me show you this one. Yeah, just absolutely stunning. So yeah, y'all definitely wanna check this out. I think I was able to get it for like $15, which honestly is a steal because, let me see, it comes with 12 different colors. So you pay a dollar and some change for each one. Not bad at all. I know I'm gonna have a lot of fun playing around with these. And actually, this was my first time playing around with um, color foils. Um, so I'm excited to play around with this. I'm thinking about trying to do some um, custom dip powders. There was um, one lady that I saw who did some dip powder nails. And, and I, this, I saw this like months ago now, actually last year. But she did dip powder nails and she used foils to kind of create like a marble look. And so I want to try to do that. When I saw it, I had wanted to try and do it, but I was like, man, I need to get foils of different colors. And when I saw this kit, I had to have it so that I could try and create my marble dip powder nails. And so thank you, Nats, for the recommendation on this kit. Absolutely love it. Oh, and then also this kit does come with uh, two tweezers here, two black tweezers. And that is just for helping you pick up and manipulate the foils. So I got this. And then the last thing that I found, which I'm even more excited about, is this Gelin Builder Gel Kit. So I saw someone reviewing it. I don't even remember who the lady was, but it's Builder Gel in a bottle. Well, not even in a bottle, in a tube. And so I thought this was like the dupe for the Young Nails Synergy Gels in a tube. And so I wanted to give it a try, and I'm likely going to do a battle of the tube Builder Gels. But let me get this open. So yeah, all right, so this is how the kit comes, right? It's Builder Gel in a tube. Like, I just think that's such a cool idea. I found this kit for only $7.99, you guys, so it was eight bucks, like super steel. And it's I know that it was a limited supply. I know when I purchased it, it was only like 10 left, so I hope you all were able to get your hands on it too when I post this video. But yeah, look at this. These are just so cute so the main reason i got this is so that when i do encapsulations and i need to use a gel to encapsulate it'll be a lot easier to have it out of a tube and with my young nails mystery boxes um i noticed that it didn't come with the clear synergy gel which i actually thought it did but it didn't and so i got this kit just for this clear so that when i want to encapsulate my nails i can so it comes with six different gels and then it also comes with um some dual forms here so I don't know about using dual forms with builder gel but that's included here in the kit and I do want to swatch these colors for you all just so that you can get an idea of what they look like so that's what we're going to do here right now and so yeah I think I'm going to start off with the clear I just want to see how clear it actually is because like I said I really got it for encapsulating so here's the clear here so we can get an idea of how this performs Seems pretty easy to work with. So yeah, having that nozzle is supposed to make life easier as far as 
working with the gels out of the tube and I can agree with that. I think it looks pretty easy to work with. And I didn't even need to pull out my brush. So I'm gonna go ahead and cure that. So that's the clear. The thing I also love about this too is the fact that it can sit up straight. So if I wanted to just keep it sitting out on the, on the table, I can and it ain't rolling around everywhere. And then here's the next one here. I noticed these actually do not have colors. So yeah, okay. So this is a beautiful pink color here. Again, this stuff seems really, really easy to work with. Loving it, loving it, loving it. And it's also nice and opaque, which is also a good thing. Okay, that's that one here. Oh, okay, this one wasn't mixed up. So that one came out clear. I thought it was a clear, so you just need to make sure you mix these up. You do them. Yeah, these are really easy to work with. Yeah. If they still have more of these, I think I'm gonna go back and get that last kit. I really like this. Okay, so I think this here is the white. I love this nozzle to help you with moving it around. That is really nice. Okay, so I did finish swatching all of the colors here, and I did notice that they do have the numbers at the bottom. So this actually is the clear. I'm a little bit disappointed in the clear. I feel like it has a little bit of a yellow shift to it. I'm not exactly sure. I feel like there's a little bit of yellowing to it, but not 100% sure, but that is 001. I don't know, you guys let me know. I don't know, you all let me know. Do you all see any yellowing with this clear? It looks pretty clear otherwise, um, but it does look like it has a slight tint of yellow to it. So let me know if you all see what I see. But that is what the clear is looking like here. Okay, so that's 001. And then for two, and this is what two looks like, which is like a nice white color here. Kind of an off-white, looks a little bit milky. Here's 003, which is like a nice light baby pink, which is a nice light pink, almost. Here is number four. This is a nice deeper pink, which is really pretty, like a bubblegum pink. This here is number five, which is more like a baby pink. And then here's number six, which is just like a deeper pink. 
So yeah, I'm definitely loving all the colors that came in this kit. I'm loving the idea of applicators, of the tube applicators. So I've not seen too many kits have that option. And so because I was so excited about it, and because I got it at such a great steal, I did go ahead and pick up a second one, y'all. Look, I can't help myself. For $8, you really can't beat the price. So this is what the second kit is looking like. So I noticed that these didn't really have any numbers to them, so I just kind of numbered them myself. And I did already swatch them just to save a little bit of time. But this is what the first color from the kit looks like. Let me go ahead and put this to the side. But yeah, this is what the first color from that kit looks like. So it's kind of like a nice neutral, kind of brownish looking color. And we have like this color here, which is kind of like a mauve nude. So this is like their new collection. And that's what that looks like. And then this kind of looks similar to the first one, but another like nudish looking color here. This one is more of like a soft pink color. And then we also have like that deeper pink, deeper mauve looking pink almost. And then we also have um, another pink looking color. So I thought these colors were absolutely beautiful. So yeah, I thought the colors that came in these two kits were absolutely beautiful. Um, yeah, so this is what they look like at a glance. This is the first kit right here, and this is the second kit right here. So, yeah. Okay, so this is everything that I picked up during my most recent Amazon nail supply haul with also a little bit of Dollar Tree items sprinkled in here. I hope you all enjoyed this video. I am super excited to play around with everything. This practice hand, she's gonna get a lot of use. Like I said in the video, I need help naming her. So what do y'all think I should name this beauty? You're gonna be seeing her a lot in future videos. Let me know which item you all wanna see me play around with next. I have already played around with these foils and they are absolutely stunning. Just simply love them. Um, I think I want to play around with this builder gel in the tube. I just really like the idea of an easy applicator when it comes to gel. With me, I like no fuss and I like it to be as easy as possible. So yeah, I hope you all enjoyed this video. Um, I do upload every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. Thursdays in particular are my nail therapy Thursdays where I premiere my videos and tune in live with you all. So yeah, if you all like what you saw here, definitely stick around, join the happy family. I'd love to have you. And as always, you guys, leave some love in the comments down below and I'll see you in my next video. I hope you all have a wonderful, awesome, spectacular day. Bye.